ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ವೀಕ್ಷಕರೆ ಬಳ್ಳಾರಿ ಬೆಳಗಾಯಿತು ಚಾನೆಲ್ಗೆ ಸ್ವಾಗತ ಜಿಲ್ಲೆಯಲ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರತಿನಿತ್ಯ ನಡೆಯುವ ಎಲ್ಲ ಆಗುಹೋಗುಗಳನ್ನ ತಿಳಿದುಕೊಳ್ಳಲು ವೀಕ್ಷಿಸಿ ಬಳ್ಳಾರಿ ಬೆಳಗಾಯಿತು ಯೂಟ್ಯೂಬ್ ಚಾನೆಲ್ it just mentioned uh, mentions about the passenger movement but i was actually asking about the overall growth of uh, aviation sector especially in karnataka sir i uh, i thought uh, you would be giving us info information about the airport infrastructure number of new destination number of flights jobs and also the revenue earned but you have just given the passenger movement information in this i want to ask a specific question it's re regarding balari from where i come from land for the airport was given long back land was already acquired uh, work was started and i don't know for what reason the work has stopped there and this is also the case with raichur airport and many other airports in karnataka i want to ask the minister when will the work sta start and when will it be completed thank you sir as far as uh, what the member has asked with regard to uh, passenger movement in karnataka and infrastructure in karnataka Karnataka uh, has uh, always been a bellwether state in terms of uh, growth in uh, in civil aviation. Uh, roughly, it uh, composes composes of 10% of the civil aviation traffic in the country. Uh, in the last year, uh, prior to pandemic, we had total passengers in the country of close to about 3.5 crores, of which Karnataka uh, had contributed uh, close to about 35 lakhs. Uh, and we are looking at a steady progression in the years to come uh, close to uh, 404 million passengers in uh, the year 23 24 of which karnataka again will contribute close to about 10% which is about 40 million as far as bellari airport is concerned uh, upsapapadi mode uh, this is a state government airport uh, we have been in conversation with the state government the state government had entered into an agreement with a private party uh, to uh, uh, put in place this airport unfortunately uh, for for many multiple reasons that has Absolutely not been possible the the uh, state government has taken legal opinion and uh, we have said very clearly that they should take whatever Demarest action to make sure that this construction starts as soon as possible so we'll please thank you second second uh, second second money for sir second ja second supplement yeah. uh so again uh, the minister has missed uh, uh, mentioning about the jobs flights new destinations and the revenue earned in karnataka he is just mentioning about the passenger and again regarding balari again regarding balari the work has been stopped he has still not mentioned when will the work start and when will it be completed mm -hmm. so my second question is is the government thinking of opening up uh, defense air strips to civilians in the places where there are no airports especially are uh, in places like karwar in karnataka where a new naval air strip is coming up will these kind of defense air strips will be opened for civilians especially where there are no airports thank you Sir, categorically answer the honorable member with regard to the belari airport and i have mentioned very clearly that the state government has to take a decision whether to terminate the agreement with the party or not that is the state government's decision we have given them an advisory that they can go ahead and do it as far as uh, using uh, defense airports naval or air uh, for civil aviation uh, purposes we are in dialogue with the ministry of defense on multiple air strips uh, and we are seeing wherever there is a demand for air connectivity those air strips we are uh, directly in dialogue with the defense ministry to be used to be able to develop under udan ude desh ka am nagrik to provide connectivity to those areas thank you ಬಳ್ಳಾರಿಯ ನಿರಂತರ ಸುದ್ದಿಗಾಗಿ ಬಳ್ಳಾರಿ ಬೆಳಗಾಯಿತು ಚಾನೆಲ್ ನ ಸ